Welcome back to Powerhouse. We just learned how the labels on light bulbs are getting more and more user friendly by giving us more information. So where can these bulbs make the biggest impact in your home? Well, Lisa Clark is a lighting designer with Ferguson and she joins us now to talk about how lighting can make a big difference in your home. So do people really take the time to seek out the proper lighting for their home? Absolutely. People are spending more time finding the perfect light for their house, whether it's a new house or just one fixture. So what are the areas that people use most in their house? And then if we look at those areas, what's the best kind of lighting for those areas? Sure. Probably one area that's most used in a home is the kitchen. That's where people are gathering, they're prepping food, they're socializing with doing their... Doing homework. Doing homework, <laughs> absolutely. So lighting is very important in the kitchen. Um, usually we're looking for three layers of light in the kitchen. One would be some type of task lighting, a general task lighting, which most commonly right now it's recessed cans. Um, another layer of light would be a direct task, which would be maybe some kitchen under cabinet lighting. And then the third would be is just some ambiance light, um, which could be kitchen pendants over an island. Mm -hmm. Why don't you walk us through your process when homeowners come in to see you um, and they say I want to make some lighting changes in my home or I'm constructing a new home. Sure, What's sure. What's your process? Some customers will come in with a floor plan and we will sit down and talk about where lighting is important and then we'll go through the showroom and get a good sense of style and color along with maybe some other selections that they've made. For instance, if they've picked out kitchen cabinetry or the flooring already, we'll base it around something that they've already picked out or just some ideas that they've researched. Now, if I wanted to use LED lighting, which is probably the most efficient lighting out there, mm -hmm. uh, but it is an investment like anything, any new technology, where should I start in my home if I'm gonna go slow? Sure, um, one area that people come in and ask most about if they're changing a fixture to LED is a kitchen under cabinet lighting. That's one area that will help save some cost for the use of the fixture and also lower the heat in the kitchen. If a client is having a two-story foyer, um, most people think, how do I change the bulbs? How often do I have to change the bulb? So with an LED light source, light bulbs will last about 50,000 hours, which is about 20 years. Um, so not changing a light bulb in 20 years, imagine that. Right, right. Another great place would be an exterior fixture. Um, just having the sense of security, knowing when you turn on the switch, the light bulb will be on. Mm -hmm. Nothing's worse than changing a bulb in the middle of winter. For those viewers that want to evaluate their home's energy efficiency regarding lighting, what are the ways that they can save with lighting? A couple ways that you can save with lighting is simply changing your incandescent bulb to a LED light bulb. Another way that you can save is purchasing a fixture that already has the LED module inside the fixture. Yes. Great. Thank you so much, Lisa. Thank you. We liked being here. Thank you. If you'd like more information about lighting fixtures or the bulbs that go in them, visit our website at powerhousetv.com.